obstacles But when we fall, we get up and go, baby The way they think is paradoxical friends nine days until December 4th nine more days until you guys know everything until then here is another weekly vlog starting with Saturday I had a few more copies of a sucky love story to send out to some close friends I'm only showing you this because of Rex who's on the cover mm -hmm. That is mama. You should open them all to the first page. After going to the post office and mailing the books, we headed to Scottsdale, Arizona, to the junk in the trunk. They had like a pop-up show. <laughs> Why not? We actually just ran into my cousin of all people. I guess she just moved here. After junk in the trunk, we went to the Sweet Salvage antique show and it definitely had me feeling the holiday spirit. Sunday, I was back in the studio. I just finished doing a pickup day for Audible because they always have you record for three days or two days, depending on your book length, or four days or a week. And then you have to come back just to the studio to do things that you said wrong, like where I didn't include a word or mispronounce something or hit a P too hard and popped in the mic or, but it, it, I'm done. Rex, where are you? Where are you? There you, there you are. Oh, he's not here. He's not there. Hmm. <gasps> there he is. I see him. I see him. I see him. I see him. I, I see I see him. Where are you? After recording, we had a few things we still had to get done. My heels are trash, so we're going to get them fixed on these boots. Bubble distraction during haircut Monday. This morning, I'm feeling a little bleh. I'm having a hard time getting moving even though it's work day because I stayed up till 2 a.m. reading Brittany Louise Taylor's new book. Mm. I sat down to start poking at it and ended up binge reading it till 2. Brittany and I have been work friends for a long time since we've been working in the same industry for a lot of years and I really admire and love her but this book is about her and how she got into an abusive relationship and then how she rescued her and her son from that relationship. Anyway, I couldn't put the book down. I definitely am gonna make Brooklyn and Bailey read it too because it's so interesting and good for them to see what an abusive relationship looks like and feels like so they don't make some of the same mistakes and they can learn from Brittany and her experience. Brittany, you're awesome, I love you. Oh, Mindy, that was so sweet. Who are you? Who is this thing? Hi. Mama. That is Mama. Look, finally, it's on Audible. And boom, it's on the Audible website too. Finally. Tuesday didn't film, Wednesday did film. I have just been working and mommying all day and it's, what is it? It's 10, 11 p.m. and um, my friend Dodie started messaging me and I was so excited because, you know, she was pretty far in my book and it was just, it's just, just, it's a relief to be able to talk to someone that knows my story or like knows most of it because she hadn't finished the book yet. But she posted the cutest things on Instagram. I'm literally sitting in the bathroom right now. These clips are the best because then Rex can't get into like my hairspray and stuff. Okay, okay, I have a friend, her name is Brittany. Brittany Louise Taylor, she's written a book. It is, it is a true story. I have written this much in one night. <laughs> I've just lived with a lot. 
that I haven't shared and I think I always try to be like happy and upbeat but it's just been a lot you guys and sport is so close to you knowing and I want I want it out there and I want to I want to educate and I want to you'll see why I'm probably just tired <laughs> I think I'm just more relieved because I'm starting to feel not so alone. Thursday was da -da -da, Thanksgiving. The pressure is on me right now to make sure that the turkey is cooked. Oh, well, I don't know. I still eat eggs, but I don't. I don't eat a lot of meat. I do salmon sometimes. I'm not fully vegan like I used to be. Okay. So you okay. Eat this and there's the thermometer. You have to what is this? Is for my grandmother. Let's go. What? Let's see how hot this turkey is. What? That's right. I'm just excited about the apple pie. Turkey is definitely done and kind of burnt. I'm not eating it, so it's fine. Nailed it. I'm going to touch your other toe. I'm going to touch your toe. Rex does not nap today. I think he just knows that it's turkey day. What are you doing? It is Friday night, and I'm sitting here editing the video, and my friend Shane just posted the sweetest things. So guys, for those of you who uh, might not know, Brittany Louise Taylor is my first YouTuber. We met like in 2008, I think. And um, something happened to her uh, a couple years ago that was absolutely insane. And she wasn't allowed to talk about it for like legal reasons. And it was a whole situation. I'm talking like actual conspiracy theory in real life about <sighs> dating somebody who turned out to not be who you thought. It's a whole situation. <laughs> um, so I haven't read the book yet. I literally just got it, just opened it, but I've heard from some people that I know that is actually insane. So um, yeah, I love her. Please support oh, Swipe Up. Him. Check it out if you like kind of, you know, stuff like that. And I'm excited. Shane, oh my gosh. I don't even know what to do with myself. And before I forget, we are having a Black Friday through Cyber Monday sale at rexkidswear.com and we're doing free shipping. And you can also bundle and save. We're doing two for 48, three for 70, and all four designs for 94. Thank you so much for helping us to help Watoto and a bunch of people that really deserve it. Thank you so much to everyone that has pre-ordered the book and I am so ready and excited for you to have all the information and to understand. I'm going to have permanent butterflies in my stomach for the next nine days. My friend Will, who normally does my special effects, is on vacation this week, so I made you guys something. It is not a special effect, but it is special. Bye.